Welcome to Emma Account Setup for Providers, Part 3. Here is a list of acronyms used throughout the presentation. You may refer back to this slide if you have any questions. For this video, we will be covering how a personal provider can join a business and how businesses can approve requests from personal providers to join. Part three, find a business to join. If you are a personal provider with an individual account, you need to follow these steps to request to join an existing business on the Emma platform. Click on businesses in the far left menu. In order to locate a business in the Emma database to request to join, use the search bar to search the business by name under the find business name. Once you locate the business, check the box adjacent to the business name and click Request. To view the status of your business request, go to the My Business tab. You can see the businesses you have requested and the status of your submissions. If you need to remove a request, simply click on the red X. On the left menu, click Businesses. Under the My Business tab, you will see the businesses that have approved your request to join. Now please note, a request to join does not equate to credential approvals. You can see if your services have been approved by clicking the My Services tab. Your status will then appear under the Status column for each service offering. Part 3 continued approving a request to join a business. Any business user can accept requests to join. Click Service Providers located on the left menu. Businesses may have personal providers request to partner with them to provide their services. Those requests can be found in Service Provider under Requests to Join. You can use the search to find a specific provider. To accept the request to join, click the check mark under Accept and next to that individual's name. To decline a request, click the X under Decline next to the individual's name. Once a request is accepted, you will see their names under the Service Providers tab. To delete an existing user, simply click the X under Remove. New requests will appear under the Request to Join tab. And please note, if a provider no longer works for your business, a business user must delete the provider from the list of service providers. Thank you for joining us for Part 3.